Hi, today I'm gonna try to repair something. This is new shock mount support, it's been widely used in aircraft for lining attachment, passenger door linings, cargo door linings, etc. Sometimes it breaks and needs to be replaced. Now look how does it look like when it's broken. I decided to save some of them from being just thrown in a trash can by taking them to my home and uh, try to repair them at home. No! No! But what is the main reason of why it comes unserviceable? Turn rubber! To repair the shock mounts we decided to remove old rubber, insert the insert nut and fill the emptiness with sealant. To buy sealant and insert nut we had to visit our store. <laughs> we had to visit our store. Going back home with all the goods and buying coffee in coffee machine. Look what did we get in <laughs> sealant mm, uh, and other things we didn't need it, but insert not. Removing old rubber. Inserting insert not and locking it with masking tape, which will also prevent sealant from leaking. Filling emptiness with sealant. To make sealant layer look good, so I touch it with my finger, I put in wet soap cloth before. Now let them dry for 20 hour hours. Everything seems to be cool, but no, that's bad. There is no sealant on the bottom, it couldn't reach this side because of high viscosity. What to do? Let's try to fill remaining emptiness with liquid glass. Here it comes, liquid glass has no enough flexibility, but shock mount still can be used and works, just not excess the torque value while tightening. Now let's deal with that thing the proper way. Let's fill the bottom with original sealant fix all and look how will it look like. And as a conclusion. Of course, original nut is more reliable than a repaired one, but you still can use repaired one in your own application. Just tighten it with your hand. So, thank you for watching.